It's uh, my honor uh, to introduce Brian Todd Newland as President Biden's nominee to be the next Assistant Secretary of the Interior for Indian Affairs. I am confident uh, that if confirmed, Mr. Newland will be well positioned to assist and support Secret Secretary Holland uh, in fulfilling the United States trust responsibility and maintaining the federal tribal government to government relationship. Mr. Newland's prior experience at the Department of the Interior and his unique perspective as a former tribal leader provides him with deep understanding of the many issues facing tribal governments. And his voice will be critical in supporting the tribes in Michigan as well as all across the country. Mr. Newland is a citizen of the Bay Mills Indian community in Michigan, a former president of its executive council, and former chief judge of Bay Mills Tribal Court. During his time serving the Bay Mills Indian community, Mr. Newland played an instrumental role in a number of economic ventures, infrastructure projects, and the successful administration of dozens of tribal departments, employees, and programs. During his tenure as tribal president, his administration also secured funding for the construction of a $15 million healthcare facility that will serve the entire Eastern Upper Peninsula of Michigan. Mr. Newland's tenure also occurred during one of the hardest years for the Bay Mills Indian community that they have endured uh, both economically, financially, and emotionally due to the COVID-19 pandemic. His steady leadership was critical in ensuring that the Bay Mills Indian community could weather the storm and emerge from the pandemic in a stable position. Further, his nomination enjoys the support of the 35 tribal nations from the Midwest Alliance of Sovereign Tribes, as well as from tribal nations all across the United States. From 2009 to 2012, Mr. Newland served as the counselor and policy advisor to the Assistant Secretary of the Interior for Indian Affairs. In that capacity, he helped develop the Obama administration's policies on Indian gaming and Indian lands, reforming the Department of the Interior's policy on reviewing tribal state gaming compacts. He also led a team that improved the Bureau of Indian Affairs leasing regulations and worked to help enact the Hearth Act of 2012, which allows tribes to lease restricted lands for residential, business, public, educational, or recreational purposes without the approval of the Secretary of the Interior. Prior to his federal service, Mr. Newland worked as an attorney with the Fletcher Law Firm in Lansing, Michigan. He represented tribal clients on issues including the regulation of gaming facilities, negotiation of tribal state gaming compacts, the fee for trust process, and leasing of Indian lands. He graduated magna cum laude from Michigan State University College of Law and received his undergraduate degree from James Madison College of Michigan State University. Go green. Mr. Newland enjoys uh, hiking and kayaking the shores of Lake Superior and is a nature photography enthusiast. He is joined here today by his wife, Erica, his daughter, Meredith, his son, Grady, and his parents, Vicki and Gordon Newland. Mr. Newland has been an incredible partner to my office and to my staff and to many all across the, the great state of Michigan over many, many years. And I know he'll be an excellent partner to all of us upon his confirmation. Thank you, Mr. Chairman, Madam Vice Chair, for the opportunity to appear today to introduce Brian and uh, thank Brian for his willingness uh, to serve the public in this capacity. Thank you, Mr. Chairman.